Hey guys, it's homeowner Scott again with another quick how-to video. Um, today I'm just going to show you real quick how to take off or uh, your rear riding lawnmower tire. First thing I did was jack it up on the back there, as you can see. And this one I have a pat or a plug in it that I put in, and it's not holding. Plus, it's leaking from the valve stem seal. So I'm just going to take it off and get a new tire and I, there's a shop I can take it to that's going to put a tire on for me because that's a real pain to try to do yourself with tire tools especially on a little tire small tire like this so first thing I got to do is take this dust cover cap off and I'm just going to use a flathead screwdriver and try to pop it off Hopefully yours comes off that easy. And then you'll see there's a, a, cl a retaining clip right here that needs to be popped off. Let's see if we can get that off. So I, I had to use two hands to get my screwdriver and I just kind of pushed it up. See, it just kind of goes around, around that. You take that off. And a couple washers here that just slide off. Okay, and then you'll see there's a hole there with, the, they call it a square key that goes in there. Okay, let's see if we can get the tire off first. So I'm hoping it's just going to slide off this axle. I put a little WD-40 on it, and I probably will grease the axle too before I put this back on. And be careful when you pull this off. Because it has that square key and it'll it might fall and uh so i might have to do this with two hands to pull this off the axle so it's now it's supposed to pull off just by holding it with both hands and pulling it off but this thing is so tight you might run into problems like i do i gotta knock it loose behind it mm. <sighs> to get it off this axle you see if it'll pull off now and I got to watch that rectangular pin too it's unbelievable it won't come off unless I knock it off I'm gonna definitely have to grease this thing off I'm trying to tap it so it doesn't fall so it came off and you see how dry that axle is I'm definitely gonna have to grease that up before I put it back on and the key actually stayed in in there I'm just gonna knock that out. I don't know if you can see it in there the little rectangular it's like down there just a little bit so I'm not gonna knock that out okay so that's the little key I was telling you about it kind of slides in you know through here when look at all that dust <laughs> it just slides in there and when you put the tire back on that assist it staying on locks it on with the washers the retaining clip these stay on and that's it now I'm going to take it to the uh, tire store and get another one and then have them put this one on okay all right, guys, that's it. Y'all have a good day.